Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we are playing City Skylines where I'm going to recreate Ireland because there's quite many problems with our country and I think I'm the man to go back in time and fix them. Ow, me hurt myself. All right, new game, city name. Oh, I've got the chance to rename it. Direland, not as in dire land, it's just Ireland, you know? It's the Ireland. God, my cleverness amazes me sometimes. <laughs> All right, so Northern Ireland, uh, I might just forget about that. <laughs> I know that some other country is gonna take it off me anyway. Yeah, Cork down here, uh, Dublin up here. I guess I'll go straight to Dublin first since it's the closest. I don't have highways unlocked. God damn it. Okay, I might have to build like a little town here first. I don't know where this is actually coming from, by the way, since it's coming from up here. Like there's not a landmass there, but there's nothing up there, so I don't know where this road leads to. Hopefully the North Pole, which means we're first on Santa's list and we'll get all the best items. All right, since I don't care about this section of Ireland because it's going to get taken away from me, I guess I'll just build dirt roads here. Why is it elevated? Why would you go to the trouble of building a bridge just to put a dirt road on it? Okay, there you go. A nice little dirt off. <laughs> This is essentially what happens. It's like when you get to the Irish part where the Or government is in charge. It's just dirt road. It falls apart. More pothole than road. Rail lines? Nah, we don't connect the north to the Republic. All right, so that's where you get off the highway. It's like a massive four-lane highway and then it goes down to this dirt road. All right, there you go. You're allowed build. Go for it. There are no cars coming and I don't know why. <laughs> Actually, I may know why. There's literally nothing here. Oh, wait, they're building something. I hope it's like a convenience store. <laughs> the most inconvenient convenience store you've ever seen. What do you mean you want water and power? For God's sake. Why did this new neighborhood have to be filled with wingers? All right, well, we got water for you here. We'll just put this uh, coal plant right at the entrance to the town. <laughs> it's just a sign of things to come, you know? What do they... Oh, they all want guns. Understandable? Oh, no, wait, that is sewage. Okay. All right, we don't want to put it close to their water line, so we'll put it up here at the other side of this lake, and we should be fine. There we go you have everything and you're none the wiser of what's gonna go wrong in the future because well i don't really care about you guys god when you come out of the other view it's actually even more depressing somehow okay there's demand for houses so let's just build a little dirt track up here <laughs> all right look just just build a road across the entirety of northern ireland up here and we'll just build loads of residential it's just a straight line of houses there you go lovely it's like a feckin landing strip like honestly this guy's probably just looking as this whole country is an airport it really looks like one. What do you want? What are you complaining about? Not enough workers, is it? Well, I'm sorry. Nobody wants to live here for some reason. Oh, yeah, I gotta power that whole strip of houses now as well. Why did they go to the middle? There was loads of land here available, but they went right into the middle of this road to start. Oh, my God, this is costing me so much money. How much money do I have? Oh, my God, I'm spending all of my money. But at least they have water. Filthy, filthy sewage water. <laughs> all right, guys, you're gonna have to do me a favor here. You're gonna have to build a house is all the way down here to connect to the power line. Otherwise, I'll have to run power lines all the way up to these houses, and that's not something I want to do. So just keep building, all right? And think of it as a long-term investment. While you might have a horrible, shitty life right now... Sorry, I, su I shouldn't say it shitty. It's a bit of a sensitive topic in this town. But in the future, you'll have nice life. Still shitty like literally, but you will have lights. At least you'll be able to see how filthy your water is. Look at all these cars coming in now. They're all looking at the new houses. Could you just build closer, please? I'm going to speed up time until they connect up my power lines. Honestly, it's looking it's looking like South Korea, North Korea at the moment. You can see this side lit up and this has nothing. Oh, now it's lit up by them complaining that they don't have power. Not enough electricity. No, you've none at all. All right, there's a rising need for industry. How about that? Look, just build industry here. I will connect this and I will do it for free. <laughs> I have no choice. I'm down to seven grand and I, I am just losing money. What are you complaining about? You know, besides all the things I've already listed out. Not enough fuel. The coal power plant turns coal into electricity. Ah, so you're saying you need coal. It's trying to get me to build a water treatment plant, but like, I don't have the money for that. <laughs> just buy one of those Brita filters. You know, you pour the water in, it's a little jug and it filters it. There's an abandoned building. Oh no, they're all abandoning the houses. <laughs> 
<laughs> Meanwhile, there's someone here just building. Oh, it looks like a fresh new neighborhood. Should be nice to raise some kids here. Get some mud on the tires. <laughs> oh, someone's happy. Oh, the person who just found a place to build. Oh my God, you idiot. <laughs> Why are you happy about this? What are you doing? Right, I'm going to dezone this area so that they'll start building towards me at least. I should have started down here, but look, what's done is done. We can't do anything about it now. We can only learn from it, which I will not. We need more power. God damn it. Can I just buy coal? Like, it's not even powering North Korea yet, and so we're in major trouble here when it needs to. Congratulations. I don't know why you're saying that. I was just about to say the entire city's power is out. I've unlocked the landfill site, though. That's, that's awesome. Maybe I can take another city's trash and earn money that way. Look on the bright side. At least they can't, like, call and complain because we just got no power. You know, I may have been misguided when I said coal was the way of the future. What about wind? We got plenty of wind. All right, I built an air turbine. I built it near the sewage so it'll waft the smell back into town. I gotta think forward, you know? I want everyone to move to Cork when I have that utopia built. Okay, do we have electricity now? We do. Okay, great. Not enough for everyone, but soon we'll be connected. Don't you worry. <laughs> We're only a few streets away. Well, actually, it's one street. That's a great PR spin. I can say, look, Ireland is doing fine. Sorry, the Ireland is doing fine. We have one street that's without power and water. That is it. It's just a very, very long street. <laughs> it goes across the whole country. What do I need? Residential. I need you to build. Build here. They're not building. All right, I have an idea. What if I dezone this entire side of the street and I just demolish their houses? I wish it was daytime so I could actually see what I'm demolishing. I want to look into their eyes as I destroy their houses. Oh no, they've abandoned over here too. Is it because of the smell? Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> the sewage just wafting straight to their house. God damn. But look, my plan is working. I got rid of all these houses and now they're building on this side of the street. So slowly but surely, they're getting there. It honestly would have saved me money just to build the power lines over to them. I've lost so much money from all the issues that have been caused by not just building it in the first place. But it's the principle of the matter now, I'm afraid. My citizens are sick. Gee, I wonder why. I guess I'll build a hospital. Actually, no, this town doesn't need a hospital. They'll be fine. I think I'm close enough to connect these now, though. That's not too bad. Yeah, that's only a thousand to connect that. There we go. You have power, everyone. Welcome. Oh, a lot of you already gave up on me. I don't blame you. Taken out the trash. Taking out the trash. You didn't believe in me, so now I'll demolish your house. Not the catchiest of jingles, but it helps when you deliver bad news in the form of a jingle. Landfill? Sure, why not? <laughs> May as well build it next to these people. They're already suffering enough, but whatever. They're so unhappy. <laughs> but look, I'm generating money now. This is great. This is what an economy feels like. <laughs> Stop trying to remind me to build a hospital. Don't wanna. Okay, I think we're slowly but surely funding our way to building the next city. Uh, highway, when is that unlocked? Um, need a population at 3,000. Oh, man. I'm going at like five a week right now. <laughs> oh my god, I need like 10 grand to build a dirt road to Dublin. Are you serious? <laughs> like, just get someone in a truck to drive over there. It'll create a dirt road. Why are we out of power again? What's wrong? Oh no. Oh no. We're losing money. We're losing money. Hold on. Hold on. I, I need a loan or something. Oh, wait. Wait. I disconnected this side of the city by accident. I built a road over the power lines. Oh, Jesus. This may have been a bad idea. How am I going to get around this? Everyone just Band in North Korea. God damn it. <laughs> I like how I just renamed this to North Korea now. All right, loans. Um, 20 grand? Sure. <laughs> and I'll build their own wind turbine over here. I think that's the best solution because I cannot cross that road. I did build the city a bit strangely up here. <laughs> Not much thought went into it. I'm just running the bulldozer over everyone at this point because um, everyone abandoned it. And uh, that's a slight problem because now there's nothing connecting the houses anymore. So that little gap that we filled with the power lines. Not really relevant anymore. <laughs> There's a much bigger gap now. What's wrong with you now? You're just dying? <laughs> really? That's a bit selfish. I've got a lot going on right now. Can you stop being sick? Just Feck the coal, all right? Turn it off. <laughs> We're not using it anyway. We're using the smelly wind. Oh my god, it's also blowing on the landfill, I just realized. Oh, I can get a loan of 60 grand if I just reach a population of 1,100. That's doable. I'm almost there already. Ignore the fact that it's going down. Look, like, there's a demand for residential. Wait, no, no, no. Don't do the same mistake again. Stop, Kevin. Stop. Hold on. Stop building. Okay, there we go. Now, residential next to the other residential who are also without power. How did that happen? Is there just not enough? 
That, that is possible, to be fair. <laughs> May as well just build another one here, I guess. <laughs> Piss off the same people doubly so, rather than pissing everyone off slightly. How are my kids supposed to be play outside when this is happening industrially? <laughs> Look, why would you want to play outside anyway? The place is just awful. Look, we're a worthy village now. What the? Why? We're a country, not a village. <laughs> what are you trying to say? Why are you insulting me? All right, well, whatever. I don't care what you say. This means I can get big bank loan. <laughs> oh, this is such a bad idea. Oh, this country is built on debt. Both types of debt. <laughs> such an abrupt end. All right, I'm gonna go with the one road strategy, we're gonna call it. Oh my god, that costs so much money. That's so much, that's so much money. Oh dear. I need to spend 84,000 to get down as far as Dublin. Is that worth it? That doesn't seem worth it. I'm good. I'm done. It's done. All right, we're done. We're in Dublin. All right, you guys just keep making money steadily away up here. You're the backbone of my economy, but I'm not really gonna care about my posture and I'm gonna let you kind of fall apart gradually, okay? You're self-sustaining. Ignore the, the the poop color in that corner of the lake. It's algae. Set policies. Hmm. Smoke detector distribution water use. Uh, it all sounds complicated and like I need to spend money on them. Ignore them. I just realized this road would have cost a lot less if I didn't raise it. I, I think I saved beforehand. Maybe I should load it and do that because I spent a lot of money on that. Yes, I did. Look at how horrible that looks. Oh, it's a sight to behold though. Am I happy to see it? I sure am. Okay, so down ramp here. Perfect. Very, very steep. <laughs> God damn it, there's gonna be a lot of people ramping down here. A lot of car accidents. It's like a highway and then just a, an off cut here at, at a right angle, a ramp down. No like merging or anything. You just turn right <laughs> immediately. Okay, let's see how much this costs me now. Way better, way better. Jesus, we can go right to Cork for the same price. All right, this is the start of Dublin. Anyone wanna live in this fake capital? <laughs> Poor marketing. For those of you who aren't Irish, which is most of you, there is an ongoing... Uh, kind of a joke more than anything that Cork is the real capital. That's where I'm from, so... We're rolling with that. Industrial waste found in the soil. Stop complaining. It's not the end of the world. Wait, why aren't they using the road? Ah, I built a one-way road all the way around, so there's no actual way to leave. That's okay. I can fix that. Oh my god, and they both go this way. Okay, no, hold on. I can I can fix this. If anything, this is good. I like one-way systems. They simplify everything. There we go. Now we're building. Now we're talking. I don't know why this road goes off in over the water. It's just a quirky thing. Dublin really likes it. It's lopsided for sure. All right, I gotta get you guys power before I start running out of money again. <laughs> I don't suppose I could divert all the sewage back up north, could I? <laughs> Is that possible? That could just be sewage city. It's 10 grand, but it's kind of worth it to make the poop lake. It's going straight upstream <laughs> into the lake that the other place is drinking from. I didn't even care this time that it was, it was close to their drinking water. Didn't even bother putting it at the other other side of the lake, which actually probably would have been cheaper. Or, you know, even maybe here, just far away from everything. No, I specifically went out of my way to say, feck you guys. But also at the same time, would you mind powering that for us? Because otherwise our, our poop water can't flow. There we go. Thank you very much for powering that. Appreciate it. Stop abandoning houses just because you can't have power, electricity, or sewage for like a few months. <laughs> like you knew that when you feckin' bought the place. Tiny near town. tornado warning for the area. What? Residents should seek shelter immediately if any is available. Um, that's not good. <laughs> All right, well, we're at Tiny Town now, so yay. And uh, yeah, we're unlocking some stuff. Wow, look at this stuff. Wouldn't mind getting the spire. I could build a spire. Where's the tornado? Oh, sure, that's in Galway over there. They're, uh, sure, they'll be grand. They're all right. They're used to that kind of thing over there. Strong winds that side of the Atlantic. I'm sure it won't reach me. And if it does, hopefully it swings up north and goes to Sewage Town. Look, folks, everyone calm down. That tornado is moving so damn slow. It's not even going to reach us. And if it does, it's probably for future generations to worry about. Police and crime. We have no crime here. The only criminal is me, funnily enough. Oh, up here might have crime. I see. Okay, well, that's not really my problem, is it? Shift terrain. Ah, maybe I can make the spire out of dirt instead of actually having it as an object. Oh, no, wait, I'm digging. Sorry. Dig up, men. Dig up. This poor person is just trying to build their business as I build this giant dirt pile next to them. Landscaping cost. Would you really call this land? 
landscaping at, <laughs> at this point. They probably even purchased this plot for like the seaside view. And then I just built this giant dirt mound where they can't even see the sun anymore. You don't even know if it's daytime or nighttime half the time. Keep her going. <laughs> I'm just curious how high this can get now. It just keeps going. I was about to say, I hope we don't get like an earthquake or anything that could knock it down. But forget that. I hope we don't get any rain. <laughs> even a mudslide could destroy the city at this point. Especially that bridge and water treatment plant. How are my kids supposed to play outside when this is happening? Play on the feckin' spire. <laughs> okay, I accidentally let go. Spent about seven grand there so far, but it's looking pretty good. <laughs> what the hell is this? It actually gets like blurry at the top. You can't even tell anymore what's going on. Look at how fast that is raising because it's just such a spike at the top now. And it's off my screen again. There we go. Now that is a spire, Dublin. <laughs> I thought you were thinking or two today. Look at that for a shard. That's where the final boss would be if this were a video game. Well, well it is a video game. I mean, a different type of video game. More residential. People just want to live in Dublin. I don't blame them. The place is beautiful. Nice bit of shade <laughs> for, for those sunny days. Industry is collapsing because we are lacking police stations, water, and just general human rights. Yeah, but we have saved up a bit of money, so I am going to build a police station to keep the, the riffraff under control. There you go. Oh, now you, local police station, take care of the entire country. I accidentally built it away from the power line, so if you guys could just build towards it, that would be great. <laughs> You'd think I'd learn from my mistakes. Didn't I say that earlier as well? Like this has been a learning experience and then I just completely disregarded it. Where's that tornado? Is it still coming? See, it died down. The mayor knows best. Am I mayor or president? I think dictator. <laughs> Poop Lake is coming along nicely. The spire is lovely. <laughs> this is a fantastic country so far. I'd live here. I do live here. I live in a worse version of this place. How hard is it to build a working power grid? It's not exactly state-of-the-art technology. It is. No one understands it. Look, this thing. This this thing over here is our god. <laughs> this thing gives us power. This allows us to play Xbox. And it also wafts the sewage smell over to us. I think I actually need more wafting. Uh, we're running low on power. Let me give you another little tower here. There you go. Now we've plenty of electricity for all. Magic. <laughs> it's honestly the only way I can uh, explain it. Hooray for the mayor. Yes, Thomas. Everyone on this Twitter app is banned except for Thomas Hancock because he's just sucking up to me. I was confused for a second. This one street didn't have water, but the other street did, but that's because I was rerouting the water all the way up here. <laughs> I like how I didn't even follow the road, which would have been super helpful if I did. <laughs> I instead went direct to the lake. Oh, what a disaster. And now I need another line that goes off this way. <laughs> for feck's sake. <laughs> well, that's a waste of three grand and more by the time I get all the way up there. You know what? I'm not going any further. This is fine. I don't want to go up to Sewage Town anyway. Build a park area? Why not? Here, we'll put it in the, the shadow of the spire. <laughs> there we go. That's Cypress Gardens, everyone. <laughs> I don't think there actually is anything there. <laughs> it's just a flat plane. <laughs> Here, I'll put like a gazebo in the shadow of the spire. It'll be handy as well. It's like the biggest sundial known to man. Wait, what the hell? Someone just deleted half the spire so they could build their shitty store. Oh my god, this is actually still zoned. I still had the spire zoned. <laughs> They're like, yeah, I'll build there, thank you. We'll get the excavators in. It's a general store. <laughs> Some random mom and pop store just opened and destroyed a national landmark. Okay, it's gone. The land's back. Perfect. Mom and pop went bankrupt. <laughs> we celebrate that in our culture. Oh, you need more waste disposal. Okay, bring that up to sewage town up here. Place another one there. Oh, why are you complaining about power now? Like, I'm giving you so much power and you're just, you're using it inefficiently is the problem. All right, more wind farm, I guess. What's this? What happened here? A fire? Idiots. <laughs> it's again their fault. Oh God, there's fires breaking out everywhere. Did my people just feckin' discover fire or what? I haven't had a single fire the whole time and now fire is everywhere. It's spreading like some sort of fire or something. <laughs> garbage is a problem, so I raised the budget for garbage a little bit. I mean, I could... 
else. Shut up, a building burnt down. I don't care. I could build a landfill down here somewhere, but I want to ship it all up here. Oh god, that lake is very polluted now. <laughs> Sorry about that, uh, Loch Ney. Also, uh, it's mainly Armagh and Straban. Is that it? Strabane? I don't know. It's the center of Northern Ireland, in brackets, UK, that I'm destroying anyway. I'm probably offending a lot of people, but you know what? That's okay. There's a lot more important things to worry about, like Poop Lake over here. More and more people want to move to my town, you know. I've noticed that there's a demand here, and I'm going to build smart for once. There we go. The roads are connected correctly, so the one-way system works. They're definitely wonky as hell, but that doesn't matter. We got loads of land. We're in Ireland, for God's sake. And this time, I'm going to build here. So that means they can only build there, and the power from these houses that don't have power because the energy system is overloaded can go through their houses and into the next ones, and then I'll build along here steadily. I can do the same on this end to make it even faster. Now, onto the issue of no power at all. What's wrong with ya? You just don't have enough, do ya? What about this advanced wind turbine? It's going in the water. Look at that. Now you'll have plenty of power. Look at that. We're in the green. Look, everyone. We're in the green on something. Ignore the burning buildings over here. And don't you dare go to sewage town. Even the roads are just destroyed here. Everything is awful. I'm gonna change my Twitter bird thing to a guy with sunglasses because it looks much cooler. Although I don't think you need them uh, in this city. I think the, the spire provides enough shade. There we go. Built a fire station and a hospital. They are so blessed that they don't live up here. <laughs> Fishing industry. Oh, that might be good. I've got lots of water. Fishing route. I don't know what this does. We'll build a little dock. Connect that up, I guess. There we go. I don't know why it's so squiggly and why you can only fish here specifically. But if you get lost, look for the spire to find your way back. How am I doing on those loans that I took out? This might be the first time in a game that I've actually repaid a loan. Look at that. It's paid off. And I only have 42,000 on this one remaining. But the fact that I paid back anything at all is amazing, honestly. This is an outlier for sure, but I'm happy about it. Child health center increases birth rate. Yes, everyone, please increase our population. You could argue it's cruel to bring a child into this country, but you know what? I'm going to argue against that. Act like bunnies, people. Also, there's a new cemetery, so when you're done making babies, you can die now. I'll put that up in uh, Sewer Town. <laughs> All the bodies will be shipped to Sewer Town. You need water. Why do you need water? There we go. Nice graveyard. We already have a few customers, I see. Oh, we've got a lot of customers. A lot of people coming in and out of the graveyard. Closest thing to nature in the city are people's house plants. How about a park or two? I use the graveyard. Come on, stop being needy. The king residence. Oh, the king is dead. <laughs> Phew, at least I'm not the king. I'm the dictator. Oh, God, I did the fishing route wrong. Sorry, guys. I thought you could just figure it out amongst yourselves. Like, I gave you permission to fish. Do I really need to point in which direction? I don't know anything about these things. In fact, I don't know anything about anything I'm doing today. Some would argue that I'm underqualified for the job, but I would argue I'm overqualified. I'm not going to argue because I don't really have a lot to back that up, but I would try to argue. Okay, honestly, I have no idea how to do this. You're just going to have to figure out fishing yourself. For feck's sake, drop a line in the water with a hook on it. That's all you need to know. You really, you want to get the dictator involved in how you catch the fish or where you catch the fish. I have other things to concern myself with. Like, people want to move in for once. Look, look at how much demand there is to live here. Okay, Dublin is looking pretty good, especially the spire, I would say. We're making money, no problem. People want to live here. They're building houses, which means the backbone of our society is no longer really needed. Like, we're going to keep Poop Lake. We're going to keep pumping that up there until that whole lake is just filled with poop and it becomes like a, a man-made wonder of the world. But we don't need this section, so we're going to begin deconstructing it. Of course, I don't really want to pay for labor to do that. Um... There must be another way. Astrologists report that a devastating meteor will strike the city in the near future. Oh, well, what a coincidence. What, what were the odds of that happening? Astrologists report that a devastating oh, meteor will strike the city in the one? near future. Residents Hell of a coincidence right there. Oh, Astrologists report a third that a one. Devastating meteor will Let's just see how this plays out, I guess. Oh my god, look at them going in. <laughs> All right, well, it's it's definitely clearing the way. Perhaps a little danger close to the road here. Let's see. 
No, we might be okay. Maybe. No, we're good. We're good. That's fine. Ah, uh, you love to see it. Just nature at work. Look, everyone. Nature is healing again. Oh, Jesus Christ. There's not a shred of life left. Even their escape routes were blocked. It was as if it was coordinated or something. It cut off their escape route and then struck them. God, that one got hit twice, basically, on the same spot. They say that lightning never strikes twice, but I guess it doesn't apply to meteors. I'm just going to speed this up if you don't mind. I, just keep it sped up. Can you do that for me? Stop slowing it down. It's not a big deal. Honestly, it happens all the time. Okay, there we go. Every trace of life has been eliminated near here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's a little bit of rubble left and it's gone. Oh, ignore this menu that was open. There's nothing to do with what's happening here. This is a, an act of God. And no, I'm not calling myself God. It's just, it just happened, okay? Oh my God, the plane's still flying through the meteor strikes. <laughs> you brave and stupid pilot. That's a Ryanair flight for sure. Avoid the impact site and head to shelter if any is available. Unfortunately, there is no shelter left in this area. Can you stop now? This is enough meteors. Um, there's a massive tsunami from all the meteors heading straight towards Dublin. We'll just, uh... We'll save that uh, there and continue next time. That's if you want to see more. Just let me know. Drop a like, leave a comment, and we can make more. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it and hope to see you next time. Bye for now.